OTR, you're watching an OTR on the road. Okay, we're on the bus, it's an OTR video. I hope you guys are doing okay. The reason I'm talking on the bus, okay, a bit windy there. I don't, I don't usually talk on the bus, but the thing is, t today there's less people on the bus, so I'm not getting an audience. Nobody there, see? It's me and the driver. <laughs> My face mask, my face mask, but I'm not wearing it because there's less people. I want to give you more of the views and stuff, okay? From the window, we're going to, we're going to cross the bridge now, Century Bridge is called. Um, we'll cross here most days that I'm, or well, the days that I have to be out, you know, on the bus. So it's an OTR video. I don't, I don't usually do these, um, I don't usually talk on the bus, do I? I've done a few videos for like rap videos for a laugh, like, for, like, for music, no like, video scenes, but or a few clips here and there, but I don't usually talk. We're going to cross the bridge. <coughs> Got some nice views. <coughs> we cross the water. As you know, I live very close by the sea, you know. Very close by the sea. It's, it's nice living by the sea. I'm never used to. The only problem is it's tropics here. It's tropics. I mean, that's not a problem, but it's like really hot. It's a lot of the time. Um, yeah. See the sky, higher buildings, the high rise buildings. Yeah. We're gonna go over the water, maybe I can show you some boats. Wow. <laughs> Let me show you some sort of boats and stuff. You know. A lot of like park type areas around here you can explore as well. That grassy. I never do because I don't go around here. There's a bus station here. No reason for me to be around it. Look over there, you can see the boats. Let's have a check over there. Have a look. Guys, look. Do you see the boats there? You can see the boats, right? Sorry about the noise on there on here as well. There's another little boat down there. Yeah. Uh, A building there. I don't know if you can see it. There's a building on the left, further in, of, ahead of you to the left. A big building, black and white. Far left. I mean, far on the left of screen. I'm not telling you to focus on the far left. No way. Um, yeah, the basic basic thing is um, there's a big building there, and it looks like uh, the building itself is a big hospital. It's like the biggest main hospital here, and it's like, as far as I know, it's like. Uh, it looks like a boat, it looks like a sh ship, sort of thing. But look at the apartments, the buildings there. It's quite a, quite a short, you know, ride really, but I have to like, wait for the buses. It's quite a short ride. So I thought I'd get you some scenery of me on the bus, you know, because you don't have some footage. Because you don't always see me on the bus. I like talking. People today. Uh, usually there'd be people staring at me as a foreigner you know, on the bus, so if I was talking like this, talking English on the bus, people would look at me like a uh, strange. <laughs> this is China, as I say. Yeah. So I'm going to get off here, my next stop. Okay, so um, yeah. So ba basically, you know, it's my bus ride. I get that every day. Most days I take that bus. Most days I take that bus every. Uh, most days, you know. Now I've got to walk back. Uh, I mean, it's, it's a bit of a walk, right? It's a bit of a walk. Miles, but it's fairly a walk, you know, a fairly long walk. For most people, it would be a long walk, but I do do a lot of exercise, as you know, and working out martial arts. But ah, walking through bushes, a little water here, a little river. You have to cross here. See, I, sh I would like to be able to cross here and go there because that bus stop over there is where I get my bus to uh, where I have to go. But to go down, if I was going over there, I'd be able to walk down there straight home and go left. But you can't cross the water, obviously. 
I'm not going to jump in and swim. I can't even swim. <laughs> but like, um, you know, I have to. I have to walk down here and get the boat across the little little bridge, little bridge like. There's other bridges back behind me, but I'm not going to go down there. Much further down. But yeah, it's like a bit of a walk, you know, a 10, 15 minute walk if you walk fast. You walk fast, about 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes walk. And uh, the same as when I get off the bus, I have to, to where I have to go, I have to, you know, again, walk about 10, 15 minutes, sort of thing, speed wise. It depends how fast you walk. There's a couple of parks around here I've shown before, like uh, there's a garage there, uh, well I say garage and petrol station, gas station. My dad, my dad used to always say a garage I think when I was younger, so. The car wash there. That car wash song, I'm not going to sing it, the old car wash song. I never used to like that song, you know. It's so boring, man. There's a lot of old classic songs, there are certain old classic songs that I just don't like, you know, certain ones. But there's so many that I do like that people just don't, you know. It's the way of the world. Not every, nobody can have the same taste entirely, can they? See, a lot of buildings, a lot of, there are buildings being built, like new buildings too. But there's always like building sites around, you'll see. Yeah. Things being knocked down, built up. I'm not going to run, man. It's just, am I going to run or not? Oh, shit, am I going to? I've got no energy in my legs. The thing is, I didn't get a good sleep last night at all. Try and cross this fucking road. That boost of energy burst. See, I have to run because I'm going to catch this green man. Yeah. Green light, as I said. The green light. Fuck me, this flying butterfly. <laughs> butterfly nearly flew in my head. Flew towards my head. So, you're getting the views. See, I'm just heading home, I'm heading home now, you know. And, um, you know, thanks for joining me every time watching the videos, you know. I hope you enjoy anything I do, any of my videos. I know, like, I use a lot of strong language in certain videos, and I express myself freely, you know. Sometimes I can get carried away, sometimes my views may be a bit different to others you know and they will be but I don't hate anyone I respect all human life even the people that I disagree with like for their way of life I respect them the same way that I should be respected and you know, we respect all life and all ways of being for me for me to not respect someone or for you to not respect someone for them you know you'd be the same you know you'd be the same yeah your viewpoints or the topics might be different, but the, the thing is the same, because you've got to respect yourself. You've got to, you've got to, uh, you've got to see that, you know? respect is the same. Really, you respect all human... Uh, you know, like all this idea about having to prove yourself to people and stuff like that. Or, I mean, yeah, you might respect someone for their abilities or something about them. But the way I see it is, the way I see it, it shouldn't be like that. I mean, the way I see it... This shouldn't be like that. Hold on, hold on. Like, to me, right, it shouldn't be like, I respect you just because of this, you know what I mean? I respect this person because this person's got a lot of confidence, or I respect this person because blah, blah, blah. No, I think that's wrong. It's like, it should be like, I respect people anyway, you know what I mean? Respect all humanity, you know what I mean? They're living, and, you know, people make mistakes, they are who they are, but if they're trying to, of course, like, I'm not saying respect like laziness, respect, you know, or don't have extra respect for like extra positive efforts that are done for someone, you know, in terms of their, towards their, their own lives and towards the world in general. If people are doing good, then of course you respect that and value that more. <coughs> you know, but I don't mean like a <coughs> respect in place of a, a lack of respect, if you know what I mean, like, you know, respecting someone in place of a lack of respect, like, if someone didn't have that confidence, or if someone didn't have that ability, or if someone didn't have that money, so what, you're gonna not respect them? Come out of all the things under the sun you wanna say, you can say anything, you can like comparing people to people, um, all that, you can say, well, no, you know, the reason, that, the reason they don't have those qualities, as you call them, and good stuff, is because they're lazy, or they just, they've got a bad attitude towards life, they're weak, they're negative in some way. 
but this is the thing you see like uh, you might not be you might not have the same negative aspects about yourself attributes you might not have the uh, you might not be such a bad or negative person as some people might be but the thing is like or level ability whatever it is but the thing is it's like you you just d disrespecting someone straight away looking down on someone immediately it makes you the same I feel maybe you think that's nonsense right? but it's like, I think really it makes you the same it makes you the same and I wanted to say it makes you worse it makes you worse really you look down on someone yeah for whatever it is for something about why you know what I'm saying? for whatever reason I don't care what it is there that that person if that person's got some negative aspects about them or if that person's got some uh, you know what I mean they don't have the quality that you you expect people to have in any way then you know it's because it's your own viewpoint your own standpoint your own vision of what life should be and that's from you it's coming from you so you can't base someone else's being on yourself you can't hold on, you can't base your your life on somebody else like you know hold on, hold on. getting some rudeness here now from somebody you can't base your um you, know, you can't base someone's uh life way of life their being everything their qualities and stuff abilities on yourself and say like, you know compare the two you can't you just respect people for who they are as human beings you know as human beings like they're not perfect but like you know of course i've got a more of a respect more higher respect level for people that do have uh, positivity about them rather than negativity that's what it is it's the attitude the attitude and then yeah you might say well attitude's one thing but like you've got to have the effort to like put steps like take steps to do stuff like, actually action make action you know do stuff so like, you might say well this person's got a better attitude about things positive attitude in life who are you to compare and what's good or bad but I'm just saying you've got someone there for basic example yeah, someone's got like uh, someone's more positive and then you've got somebody else who's more negative in their mindset you know about life and attitude and you say and, you know, yeah, because they're more positive than the other one, and you, uh, you know, positive versus negative. I'm saying, and then you basically look, and you basically look at them, um, and you you say that, you know, you think that, but the thing is, you then say, well, this person, though, what about their ability? You want to see some ability, right? Because the or effort, so steps, like someone's positive. But what did they do for themselves? Now, a step in that direction, physically, in the real life, you might say, well, that is actually more important than the attitude, even. You might say that, because it's like, God, make something, you know. But then you get confused, because you're saying, well, taking steps in a certain direction, or doing certain things, is what the kind of thing you'd respect. So you're trying to say that you'd respect someone for doing things that you see would, you would think are right, you see. But the positive and the negative attitude, even the attitude itself, you could say, is an action, part of your being and an attribute and a, um, elements about your characteristics, your character, your personality, you know. Even the attitude itself is, you know, positive or negative attitude. And the thing I'm trying to say here is, what I'm trying to say basically is that even that you can't compare. Yeah? Because it's, um, it's in a certain direction or not, you know in a certain direction as I'm saying a certain direction yeah so basically say if you've got like a your mind if someone's mind's thinking like in a certain way towards something and you start saying if that's positive or negative you see is it is it I mean, like, just because you agree with it you know what I'm saying just because it fits your what you see about certain situations in uh, areas of your life you know what I mean but the thing is like the thing is um, positivity Ultimately, it's just pureness, it's just pure, absolute, just respect itself. Love, basically, respect for the, everything around you. You know, it's love for life, you know, and respect. And what we should really say is it's a lack, it's a lack of hate. It's a lack of hate, you know what I mean? Yeah? 
So you've got creation and destruction. But then, you know, you've got creation's a, creation's a lack of or um, abs, absence of destruction, you know. But then you've also got, like, really what it is, is you've got being and not being, like existing and not existing. Life and death. So it's a long babble, me walking down this road here, talking to you. <laughs> Thanks for listening to that boring shit. But I'm just saying, uh, it's a journey, life is a journey. On the bus or on foot. But the thing is, I want to say, you know, there's a lot of areas of life, like... But whatever you study, subjects of anything, are you true within yourself? Hold on, guys. Hold on, I feel a little sick. Hold on, talking too much. I feel a little bit sick there. All of a sudden, I thought I was going to throw up. Didn't get enough sleep. Talking too much. Too hot. Walking. Don't burn yourself out. Don't burn yourself out. Don't burn your ass out. I'm thinking to do a bit more exercise later on anyway. I've been doing stretching earlier on this morning. I can hear the birds whistling. I'm sweating a bit. I don't even know if I've got to come back, back out again later on. I'm not too sure. Mmm, fuck. This is annoying. A few people around, not so many. My mask? Where's that mask? In my pocket, good. <laughs> I lost that mask there. Got some guy staring at me here. Listen back. Um, yeah, so, um, you know, talking about a lot of stuff, nature in general, nature and reality. You know, and that's what you really need to follow in life. You connect with that, you know. If you don't follow nature, you fail in life. You don't follow nature, that's, that's a true reality, it's the only reality that exists, a true honesty is the power. Anything other than honesty is weakness, so if you're acting in life and all that, it doesn't mean that you need to be strong in where you are in the world and prove yourself over people and earn power. I know that you need people in authority and jobs and law and all the rest of it, and the main thing is just decency and honesty with yourself. You want to be in control of everything because you feel that there's a lack of control in you. You know what I'm saying? You feel like, or you feel like you're being controlled. You, you do things through fear of being in the victim spot, you see. You know, again, you know, you're concerned about the execution of the technique or, or like you, you hit because you're afraid you're, you're going to get hit. That's what Bruce Lee said once, you know. Things like that. If you're in a fight situation, for example. But you think your whole life's in a fight. You're fighting for your life as though you're on your deathbed. When actually, you're on your, on your feet, man. You know. Study you know, the ways of yin and yang, as I say, Tao, the true real way of life, you know, the elements of nature. Study that. It's technology and stuff is just tools to help us, but we're all human at the end of the day, human humanity. You know? I'm going to stop this one here. Stay focused. Thanks for watching this. Take, take care.